solving this problem, I can rewrite, I can combine it to uh, log base three. Uh, so log base three of, this becomes x plus one times x plus four is equal to uh, log base three of three squared. So then I end up, and I can drop the log base three now. So I get x squared plus four x plus x plus four and I get uh, 9 over here, so this becomes x squared plus 5x, and I'm going to move the 9 over. Um, so you get minus 5. So you get minus 5 equals 0. And then plug this in the quadratic formula. So quadratic formula is this. can't tell you how many times I've written this, <laughs> but it's good to see it again. All right, so uh, we get x is equal to negative 5 plus or minus square root of 5 squared minus 4 times 1 times negative 5 all over 2 times 1. And this simplifies down to negative 5 plus or minus, um, oops, 3 root 5 over 2. Um, see here oh and actually because we got log we can only have negative so it's gonna be plus because you can't have a negative inside the logarithm and then we simply end up with 0 0.854 that's it yay